How's the day going so far? <laughs> Late Good. night for me right now. I'm ready to go home. Vancouver's downtown east side is a neighborhood plagued by crime and has a high homeless population, many of which suffer from severe mental health issues and are drug addicted. With 20,000 people living in the area, Acting Sergeant Cal DeSange leads a team of officers that constantly patrol the streets to make the area safer for those that live here and those visiting. Of course, walking the beat, uh, we make it a point of obviously looking out for these uh, drug dealer predators and going out for the addicted. Uh, we also make it a point of dropping by businesses and uh, once again, uh, establishing rapport with the merchants in the area. This is what it's all about. You're out there on the street, you're walking the beat. And uh, you're making connections, you're establishing rapport, and uh, building a strong uh, communication bridge with the community. You have to have compassion for these individuals. You can't come in uh, with this uh, sense that, I mean, you're going to impose the law on everybody. They're drug addicted. They require help. And that's what we're here for. That we want to get them help. Sanj thinks that he's a positive role model for the young South Asian population across BC because he can help lead them away from a life of gang and crime. It's a common known fact that uh, gang violence in the other Canadian community has transcended generations where, I mean, we've read about it and seen it on the TV. The thing is, as a member of the indo canadian community, it's bothersome because I know the majority of the Southeast Asian community are hardworking, have accomplished a lot uh, as a result of their work ethic. So I, I almost consider it a personal sense of obligation where I take it upon myself as a member of the Southeast Asian community to give back. So the youth need somebody that they can look up to. to build a bridge with these kids, show them that we are the good guys, and that uh, someday they can uh, aspire to be like us. Dosanch and his team have seen their hard work pay off. Over the last five years, they've seen significant improvements in the area, making it safer for everyone to walk the streets of the downtown east side. For theprovince.com, I'm Larissa Cahoot.